this is the energy vibration lesson for um, um, for the Aquarian Sun Moon and Rising um, I wanted to change my card deck because I started out with that card deck that is not so happy happy proudly but I'm just gonna go ahead and see what is happening this is a week of the Sun it's a wonderful week we begin from the 19 until the 25th I want to say to everyone out there it's the end of your birthday this is a new year for you guys so um, let's see what is coming in um, with the week of uh, the Sun you have the the zodiac energy of water so let's see what is coming in on Monday for you Aquarians you have um, the energy and I'm sorry I have to put my glasses on because that's why I wanted to use it um, another deck justice you have the energy of justice and this is positive this is extremely positive with the energy of justice so um, you Aquarians what was being unjust this is going to be good on Monday because it's going to be a positive positive a good day for you guys on Tuesday you have the energy of the five of coins not to worry about this because things are going to be picking up don't feel as if you are out in the cold because you're not on Wednesday you have the energy of temperance just be patient just be patient your spirit guides are saying just be patient things are going to be working out so you have nothing to worry about then you have the energy of the the night of ones and this is someone between the ages of 25 and 45 and this person is going to come in and some of you could be um, having the scale of justice in your behalf against that person so we're going to look at that and see what is happening then we have the energy of the king of swords and this is um, you guys so this is going to be good on Friday because justice is going to um, be taking place for you guys on Saturday you have the energy um, of the five of swords this is another good energy which whatever conflict there is you're going to win these conflicts and then on Sunday you have the energy of the magician so it's going to be a wonderful profound week for you guys because you're carrying your own energy um, um, a lot of your own energy vibration and this is going to be good okay so as I look at the week what this is what is transpiring is that whatever situation that was unjust that this king for the king of swords you and you know you are going to be overcoming the situation and um, you know if you have felt out in the cold without anything not to worry because what is going to happen is that things are going to be working out in your favor you have the energy of the Queen of Pentacles that is going to come in in the beginning of the week to help you out in whatever situation that is going on as we look forward and we see the energy in the middle of the week that is transpiring as some of you are feeling a down and out and there are conflicts but whatever the conflicts are you're going to win them you just have to have um, balance in this time because it's not very easy for me to say um, you know you're gonna win them but whatever conflicts and whatever that has been transpiring for you guys it's going to be okay you just need to have a, a um, balance and balance out whatever situation that is going on um, success this is success for a lot of you people if you're having conflicts with your father know that this is going to be working out okay just give it some time there are just karmatic things that needs to be ill because I'm seeing that they're asking you to have a little patience and to have temperance um, temperance is um, you know taking a time with people and dealing with situation last part of the week with having balance the energy of the magician is going to come in and work out something I'm not sure why this energy is coming in if some of you had situation to deal with someone who is an Aries Leo or a um, um, Sagittarian um, this person no longer has a hold on you there is um, the energy of them 
on Thursday so be aware of this but you know whatever the situation is is that there is going to be help because it's as if someone who is between the ages of 25 and 45 is going to help you against this person and see that whoever this person was that they have unjustly done things and they are not vibrating at high energy vibration because they're in and vibrating in the third dimension energy vibration you can see this because this person whoever is a older person that wasn't very honest about certain situation that was transpiring so here you are seeing this happening in the last half of the week is as if the the nights which is someone between the ages of 25 and 45 is going to come in and work against this person in your behalf so it's going to be um, positive okay let's see what's coupling um, Tuesday um, Monday with Tuesday um, the king of um, Pentacles whatever is happening with the energy of the king of Pentacles they're coupling out uh, um, Monday and Tuesday so you will have to deal with the king of Pentacles and the queen of Pentacles and this can be a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn these are people over the ages of 40 Tuesday Wednesday um, you have the six of swords you're moving away from this situation which is very good because what is transpiring is that whatever the situation is or was you're moving away from the situation and you're thinking to look at different ways and means or different situation in your life because this isn't working out as you have thought new love is going to come in between for some people on Wednesday some people on Thursday new love is going to be coming in so this is going to be good because a lot of people and this new love could be coming in from someone who is an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius between the ages of 25 and 45 as we move forward we have the energy of the Knight of Swords and the energy of the Knight of Swords on Friday and um, between the weekend you know there's gonna be success because whatever that has transpired in your life you're going to see that a lot of success is coming in because a lot of people are seeing that you know people weren't being you know very honest about certain things and um, you are going to be very very successful in um, the weekend and it's not really the weekend Friday Saturday um, for some people it's going to be Friday for some people it's going to be Saturday but it's as if something finally comes to light and people are seeing something that has transpired and they you know help is going to be coming in in the weekend you have a little feeling of failure and sadness but not to worry because things are going to be working out it's, it's as if um, the energies are changing around you and this is your new year so go back and listen to your um, birthday reading for the year um, to see what is going to be happening so um, uh, you know sometimes it's good to just look within and see um, what is happening because um, as I look at your reading it's actually success is going to be here for a lot of you a lot of you um, a lot of success is going to be here and a lot of people are going to be and you know for some of you you are going to be coming in contact with a lady who is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn and this lady is going to help you to make your life successful and it's going to help you to overcome um, whoever the um, the fire sign is or was um, that was you know making your life a misery so not to worry because things are going to be okay and things are going to be good so you know this is going to be um, positive it's going to be um, actually a positive week even though uh, you know sometimes we see the week starting off and this is not really a bad week because a lot of people are going to be coming in to help you guys love is going to be um, Wednesday Thursday a lot of love is going to come in on Friday a lot of you are going to have um, if you're looking for a new house or a work um, some of you are going to hear that on Friday between Friday and Saturday some of you are going to be hearing that so um, this is going to be good some of you have to contend with the 
um, the Taurus Virgo and Capricorn but they're actually coming in and justice is going to be you know if you have legal situation and that sort of a thing it's going to be in your favor so this is good um, wonderful you have the energy of fulfillment this is a wonderful energy to have um, the energy of fulfillment is saying that um, you know things are going to be okay you're going to feel fulfilled you're going to understand why certain things had to happen and how this is going to affect your life and now finally you know this the 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 sense of fulfillment comes in because the universe is showing you that change is, is on its way and this is a, a good year um, to begin your year with um, the energy of fulfillment let's see what the angels have for you guys um, release release and it says I release that which doesn't serve my highest purpose with gratitude and love so if you're in a relationship or you're in situation or you're in a work situation and it doesn't um, serve your highest good ask your angels and guides to come in and release this so that you can move forward in your life in a positive way and in a way of helping others and not um, um, you know kind of um, having this so for you guys it's going to be a positive um, energies beginning your year learn to release things that no longer serve you okay because a lot of releases are coming in so in this week um, you guys are going to be dealing with a lot of people but um, you know it can be love coming from um, your father and some of you you're going to be because a lot of you if you have um, if your father is a um, Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn or your mother is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn they're going to be coming in to help you and support you in whatever the situation is a lot of love is going to come at you and a lot of success so this week is like a week of love and success so it's going to be wonderful release that which no longer serve you and understand that life is full of surprises I want to say to each and every person namaste until next time